pagkakaisa ng ating stakeholders, parents, students, ay patuloy po natin kinapractice ang ating pong best practices sa ating eskwelahan, Save the Earth in a Little Way. project we use, recycled equipment, ushered a safer environment. Sa tulong po na kayong mga stakeholders, magulang, at ay mga mag-aaral. Kasama ako! Kasama ako! Kasama ako! Kasama ako! Kasama ako! Tama kami! Sama kami! Tama kami!
from Apatid Letrus. The path of Letrus was planted just for fun through our principal Tuninin Diaz. But the letter showed its fiber. It gave us joy upon realizing that it contributed the very little to food production that is paramount importance in the midst of this COVID-19 that agriculture is a life support system. It is done through hands-on training and actual management practices. It aims to produce organically grown indigenous vegetables for local consumption. The dream that began from a potted lettuce is now a wide, luscious school garden. Banghang pamaraanan, tumusatang karunungan, we are one birira. Biriran Elementary School is a newly established public institution located in the southern hinterland part of Barangay Tarusan, Batarasa, Palawan. In the mouth of the river where the school is resided, challenges always paddle in their ways. In this light, the Supreme People Government initiated a project proposal which being put into action by the stakeholders and teachers of the school as the students are not allowed to go to school because of the pandemic. This strongly showed that pandemic cannot stop us from striving in providing quality services to our learners. Bangka Pamaraanan Tungo sa Bangka Rumungan is the project entry of the school which they call the Skubang in their vernacular language. It pertains to the boat as the medium of the school in extending their both hands and hearts to continue in providing quality and accessible education to our learners. The said project was featured in the PTV4 News not once but twice due to its exemplary performances in providing services to our learners. Elementary School sa Batarasa, Palawan gagamit ng bangka rumungan sa darating na pasukan si Hari Ilagan. Humahataw! Hot 
Ikaw, Malita! Handang-handa na sa nalalapit na pagbubukas ng school year 2020-2021 ang Beriran Elementary School sa Barangay Kapusan sa bayan ng Batara sa Palawan. This project strengthens the partnership of the school to its stakeholders as it leads the transport of our services to our learners in an easy and efficient way. And for us teachers, that is to provide quality and accessible education to our learners and to the learners enriching their fullest potentials and to achieve their goals in life. As our mission indicates that, Sining ng Kalinangan, Laging Misyon ng Diriran. We will continue our burning desire to serve them. This project also increased the school's enrollment of 23% from 178 to 237 students this year. The project Bangka Pamaraanan tungo sa Bangkarunungan with its subsequent programs Bangka Tipusdan, Bangkarangalan, and Bangkarunungan is now sailing in the river of life to reach their designated port. Thank you very much. Our acknowledgement is accorded to the district heads, school heads, and staff of Andres Soriano Memorial Elementary School, Malihod National High School, Southern Batalasa National High School, Aborla National High School, and Biriran Elementary School for generously sharing and showcasing their best practices. These are valuable input and contribution that will be of great help to other schools in enhancing and improving their school-based management practices amid the challenges brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic. Further, to the officer in charge of the Office of the Assistant Schools Division Superintendent, Sir Arnaldo J. Ventura, for motivating the school heads to pursue and come up with this kind of audiovisual presentations as part of the school-based management virtual benchmarking activity. Lastly, we also encourage other schools to come up with a three to five minute audiovisual presentations of their school-based management best practices, which will be shared and showcased to other schools in enhancing and improving their SBM practices. Thank you and always keep safe, everyone. Thank you so much, Sir Eric, for that uh great video presentations and of course our congratulations and uh, to the inspiring schools and school heads for sharing your best practices and to the rest of the school heads we are challenging you you we know you are equally innovative or you can do better for a delivery of quality basic education services and we have an important announcement from our Admin Officer 5, regarding the newly launched DPMIS or Division Personal Management Information System. Um, according to Mameo, this is for strict compliance. So reminders po, yung DPMIS for compliance. And now, um, one of the highlights and most awaited part of our MANCOM is the awarding of certificates to the district schools and individuals who made an exemplary achievement in their respective areas of concern. So for the first award, Apa, sir, Sir Kevin, please. We have an award for ALS Partners in Project BALSA. BALSA means Boosting Access Literacy Services in alternative learning system. So we have a certificate of recognition to uh, Mary Dewey Dissertation, Department Republic of the Philippines, Department of Education in Maropa Region, School Division of Palawan. Certificate of recognition is awarded to Mayor Swab J. Astami, LZU of the Municipality of Balabac for the physical and financial support for DepEd Palawans and redounds, that redounds to the successful implementation of alternative learning system or ALS in Balabac for the school year 2020-2021 and for the project BALSA 
um, bank hashtag bangka aralan for us learners given at DepEd Palawan Schools Vision Office, Governor Salvador P. Socrates Government Complex, Puerto Princess City on June 17, 2021. Sign Roger F. Capas, CSO 6, School Division Superintendent. So I think. Um, so the certificate will be received by uh, to represent the municipal mayor. Um, I think virtually present is um, the admin officer of uh, of uh, Balabak, Sir Ronald A. S. Tami. So I think they are virtually online. Pwede po ba kayo makita? So this was requested by Sir Dendal na makita sila to, to receive virtually the certificate of uh, recognition. Sir Kevs, naka-online na ba sila? Okay. So we have another... And now we have another um recognition for so the municipal mayor Tane, of uh, Dumaran, Mayor Arnold T. Kaabay. I think they're also virtually online. Congratulations to municipality of Dumaran. And thank you for the full support to our ALS. Also to, to Mayor uh, Sual Astan. So you can claim for your certificate of recognition at the um, SDS office po sa secretary. Okay. So for our for our next award. Okay, yeah, sir Kevin. You, uh. For the next award. So once again, congratulations to our ALS, ALS partners in Project Balsa. Sir Kev's kindly flash our next um, award. We have another award. Let me read you the citation. Republic of the Philippines, Department of Education, Memorial Per Region, is Constitutional Palawan. Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Ross North District as the fifth for being the fifth district to comply promptly and completely the preparation and reporting of electronic school report card or ESRC as requested by the SDO Palawan through the School Governance and Operations Division. Such compliance has contributed much to the efficient delivery of services and achievement of this office del deliverables given at the School Division Office, Department of Education, Governor Salvador P. Socrates, Government Complex, P. O. Road, Barangay Banco Bancao, Puerto Princess City on June 17, 2021. Signed, Roger F. Kappa. Seso, Seso five, six, 
It's going to be superintendent. So congratulations to the fifth this fifth awardee oh, for the preparation of uh, ESRC, the Rojas North District. And you have the other awardee, the fourth awardee, the Coron Coastal District. So you can see the time stamp as we're in, uh, the time we're in the submitted the report, the time and the date, specific time and date. And the third district uh, goes to Dumaran Island. And this rank two goes to Kesson South. And rank one goes to Roa Central District. So congratulations to the top five districts for the early submission and preparation uh, and reporting of school SRC. And then we have another award for the top five schools for reporting and observation of findings on the effect of clustering schools. So certificate of recognition is given to Koran Inland District as the rank five district for the submission of the said report. And for the fourth, the rank four district for the reporting and submission, reporting observation and findings on the effect of classroom in schools goes to Roa Central District. Congratulations. And the rank three goes to Nara del Norte Districts. And the rank two goes to Coron Coastal Districts. And the rank one goes to Tai Tai Tree District. Congratulations to the to all the top five districts. Of course, this is for the leadership of their respective PSDSS. And you also have a certificate of recognition to the uh, top five districts who comply promptly and submit completely the recommendations for district, district school-based management focal person for curricular year 2021. So we have the top five, the Cuyo districts, and the top four, Nara del Norte districts, and the top three, Roa Central district, and rank one, the Tai Tai Tri district, or rank two rather, Tai Tai Tri districts, and rank one, Batarasa district. So once again, congratulations, and also to the uh, respective uh, PSDSS and school heads, of course. And for the earlier presented um, best practices of the SBM, we have a certificate of recognition for you uh, for Malihud National High School. Uh, let me read to you the dissertation um, for generously sharing and showcasing its SB, SBM best practices as a virtual Vince marking activity in the implementation of school-based management during the third division MANCOM committee meeting of the SDO Palawan on June 7, 2021. Such valuable input will be of great help to the other schools in enhancing and improving their SBM practices amidst the challenges brought about by the pandemic. Given at the school division office, Department of Education, Governor Salvador P. Socrates, Government Complex, PO Road, Barangay Banka Bankao, Puerto City on June 17, 2021. Signed, Roger F. Capas, 6, school division superintendent. So, congratulations to Malihud uh, Element High School. And also, same certificate is given to Southern Batarasa National High School. Also, same certificate is awarded to Andres Soriano Memorial Elementary School. Same certificate is also given to Beran Elementary School. And same certificate of recognition is also given to Aborla National High School. So once again, congratulations to the school heads, teachers, stakeholders of the schools um, who showed us their best practices. So you are a, such inspiring schools. Okay, we also have other awards from the SGOD. So for sharing, uh, ito na po yun. Um, nabigay na po natin. 
SBM practices. Okay. So we also an award for the early registration report in LIS based on the number of reported uh, early registered learners compared from SY 2020, 2021 official enrollment on kinder grades one, seven and 11 as of May 31, 2021. So let's start from the rank one. So the rank one goes to, ah, pabalik pa. To Coron Coastal District. And the rank two goes to Cagayan Silio District. And the rank three goes to Aborland West District. And the rank four goes to Quezon South District. And the rank five goes to Roa Central District. So you can also see on the screen, the total school year 2020-2021 enrollment and compared to total school year 2021-2022 enrolled early registered lear learners. So the, you also have the variance and the presentation. Congratulations to the top five districts through the leadership of their um, PSDSS. We also have another award. Another set of award for the compliance with the vision memorandum number 70, of 2021, the submission of three year research plan complete and signed by the members of the district research committee. So rank one goes to Nara del Norte district, rank two goes to Rizal district two, rank three goes to Batarasa two, one. rank one. Uh, Batarasa one, sorry po, Rank four goes to Nara del Sur, and rank five goes to Batarasa two. So date of submission, February 14, 2021. So all this district will also receive a certificate of recognition. Iclaim na po dito sa SDO Palawan. We also have another set of award for compliance with the report in the basic education information system uploading of MS Excel file in the system. So rank one goes to Coron Coastal District. Rank two goes to Batarasa District One District, uh, Batarata District One. Rank three goes to El Nido del Norte District. Rank four goes to Borland East South District. And rank five goes to Taitai Tri District. So sub deadline of submission, uh, second week of May 2021. Congratulations. And then another award for the schools who submitted the complete, reliable, and early submission of the report for the third quarter grades. So rank one goes to Gugognan Elementary School. School head, Ma'am Allen, a. Ortega. And the rank two goes to Imulnod Elementary School, Tatandayan Extension, headed by Sir J. Albin Arinaho. And the rank three goes to Rojas North Central School, headed by Ma'am Rebecca A. Felizarte. And the rank four goes to Imbo Elementary School, headed by Ma Mary Jane C. Tiang says, so congratulations to this very responsible at resp ah, pa pala, sorry, school heads. And the rank five goes to Lapu Lapu National High School, headed by Sir David C. Tablason. And the rank six goes to Princess Urduha National High School, headed by Ma'am Joy E. Galgo. And the rank seven goes to Broxpo National High School, Mary Edwards Ventura, Venturanza Extension, headed by Ma'am Anna Marie M. Rivera. Let's see, Kamara. Okay, so congratulations to our compliance schools. And you also have another award complete, reliable, and early submission of report for the RBI program implementation. Rank one goes to Benekan Elementary School, headed by Mam Rowena P. Gabarda. And rank two goes to Australia Village National High School, headed by 
Ma'am Nova R. Dote. So congratulations to this top two schools for the complete reliable submission of reports. And we have an individual award for the active performance in the SDO Palawan hotline during the lockdown. Okay. So we have an award for Mr. Eduardo Tibangkaya III. Okay, si Sir, tara ng ating TikTok king ito. Mayroon mag-TikTok si Sir. So from the adversative section, congratulations to Sir Third. Also, to Ma'am Excel G. Puno, our youth for, uh, in the youth from formation section. Also award to Engineer Ralph Anthony B. Monton. And also another award for Ma'am Emily B. Padroncillo of cashier section. So congratulations to this uh, division personnel. Keep it up po, mga ma'am and sir. Another award for the active participation in the submission of documents for information dissemination. Yes, we have an award from Ross Central District to Ma'am Noemi M. Ampulier. Another award also uh, to Sir Freddy T. Gamow Jr. of Santa Teresita National High School. Another award also, same award also for Ma'am Jennifer A. De Jesus of Isombo Elementary School. And an award also for Ma'am Rowena P. Gabarda of Coron Inland District. So congratulations. Of course, ito ay through the support ng kanilang mga respective PSDSS. And we have an award for the most innovative employee of the school health and nutrition section. Congratulations to Nurse Anne Christine C. Cayabo, Nurse to Senior High School. So from the school health and nutrition section. Congratulations, Nurse Lut. Okay, so that's all for the SGOD awards. We have another award, okay? So I'll give the floor to my partner, Sir Dendal. Yes. Okay. Plaque of recognition is awarded to Christy C. Gosman of Andres Soriano Memorial Elementary School, Rua South District for winning rank one in the search for top 10 best parent toolkit and the school's division of Palawan, held on May 26, 2021. Given at the Department of Education, School's Division, of, school's division Office of Palawan, Governor Salvador P. Socrates, Government Complex, Puerto Princesa City, on June 17, 2021. Signed, Roger F. Kappa, CISO 6, School's Division Superintendent. Again, Another award for the second rank or rank two goes to Michelle M. Labragi of Claudio Sandoval Elementary School. Another award, lack of recognition is awarded to Miss Jennifer L. Baringe. Rank two in the search for top 10 best toolkit in the school's division of Palawan. Another award goes to Annie T. Phylon. Same award goes to Francis Ann M. Koo. For rank three, goes to Rowell G. Manzano of Burirao Proper Elementary School. Go with this plaque of recognition is Mary Grace L. Pacaldo of Burirao Proper Elementary School, Nara del Sur District. For rank four, from Kinlugan Elementary School, Quezon South District, Virginia B. Bitico, 
rock four. Another rank four from Kinlugan Elementary School, Alisa B. Paala. For rank five from Estrella Velez Elementary School, Nara del Norte District, Nelson V. Salazar Jr. Another rank six goes to Grace E. Echavez of Salungsong Elementary School, Rizal District. Rank seven, Wina Jane P. Antoy of Barotuan Elementary School, El Nido del Norte District, rank seven. Another rank seven, Mary Grace R. Batoy for Barotuan Elementary School, El Nido del Norte District, rank seven. Congratulations to Mary Shane C. Paredes, El Nido Central School, El Nido del Sur, rank eight. Another rank eight for, from El Nido Central School, El Nido South District, April D. Misahon, rank eight. Another rank eight from El Nido Central School, Rosemary E. De La Cruz. Same certificate of, uh, same plaque of recognition is awarded to Crisan A. Pacanya, El Nido Central School, El Nido South District, rank eight. Rank nine. Mambalot Elementary School, North Brox Point, Remart C. Nagdayao. For rank 10, from Andres Soriano Memorial Elementary School, Ruha South District, Riza T. Galdo. Here are some certificate of recognition will be awarded to different districts for exhibiting active participation and with the highest number of entries in the search for top 10 best parent toolkit in the school division of Palawan held on May 26, 2021. Certificate of recognition is awarded to Batarasa District 1. Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Joseph U. Pastrano IV of Balala Elementary School, Colum District. Same Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Florida T. Ducosin of Zerong Elementary School, Quezon South District. Same Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Jocelyn Bernal of Nala Elementary School, Dumaran Mainland District. Same certificate of recognition is awarded to Cindy Daco, Tagumpay Elementary School, Coron Coastal District. Same certificate is awarded to Jocelyn Bernal, Nala Elementary School, Dumaran Mainland District. Same certificate is awarded to Lisel B. Pino, Claudio Sandoval South Elementary School, Dumaran, hmm. Coron, Coron Coastal, Element, Coron Coastal District. Certificate of recognition is awarded to Maricar P. Flores of Maranan Elementary School, Nara del Sur District. Same certificate is awarded to Melody El Mina, San Isidro Elementary School, Nara del Sur District. Same certificate is awarded to Philip, uh, Philippa Aguirre, San Isidro Elementary School, Nala, Nara del Sur District. Same certificate is awarded to Thierry Pineda of Abongan Elementary School, Taitaito District. 
same certificate of recognition is awarded to Famila Joyce Juarez of Nanabo IP Elementary School, Ruha South District. Same certificate is awarded to Angel Grace Sanchez, Nanabo IP Elementary School, Ruha South District. Same certificate is awarded to Janet Medelia, Panitian Elementary School, Sopronio Espanol, Sopronio Espanola District. Same cert certificate is awarded to Janet P. Medelia, Panitian Elementary School, Sopronio Espanola District. Same certificate is awarded to Giselle P. Ortega, Panitian Elementary School, Sopronio Espanola. Same certificate is awarded to Maria Elena A. Navarro, Malice Elementary School, South Brox Point District. Same certificate is awarded to Claudette M. Malalay, Tarusan Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. Team Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Rosana Girali, Kulandanom Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Giselle Ann Roque, Upper Lapu Lapu Elementary School, Nala del Norte District. Team Certificate is awarded to Rialin Likai, Nara Pilot School, Nara del Norte District. STEAM Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Mayael Obstaculo, Batarasa Central School, Batarasa 1 District. STEAM Certificate is awarded to Mindy S. Midano, Bidano, Batarasa Central School, Batarasa 1 District. STEAM Certificate is awarded to Kasma S. Abdurasid, Batarasa Central School, Batarasa 1 District. Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Kia N. Orchesta, Orchesta, Batarasa Central School, Batarasa 1 District. Same certificate is awarded to Plodelisa Hardin, Gotok Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. Same certificate is awarded to Ria Ipakta, Gotok Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. Team Certificate is awarded to April Rose Ladika, Bato Central School, Tai Tai Wan District. Team Certificate is awarded to Milky M. Mabirit, Bato Central School, Tai Tai Wan District. Team Certificate is awarded to Christy P. Manga, Bato Central School, Tai Tai Wan District. Sorry, Tai Tai 2. District. Realisa S. Oblian, New Genlo Elementary School, Tai Tai 2 District. Team Certificate is awarded to Julian Ledesma, Machiag Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. Team Certificate is awarded to Aida Lusada, Irene E. Cibolias Memorial Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. SIM Certificate is awarded to Marlene C. Kobilan, Bunobono Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. SIM Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Mary Grace P. Villanueva, Barak Barakan Elementary School, Batarasa 1 District. SIM Certificate is awarded to Alesa R. Hinoso, Igang Igang Elementary School, Batarasa District 1 District. Team Certificate is awarded to Perlin C. Salvani, Bulalakaw Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. Team Certificate is awarded to Genfa Daifal, Antipuluan Elementary School, Nara del Norte District. Team Certificate is awarded to Gidsel M. Aurelio, Teresita Elementor Santa Teresita Elementary School, Dumaran Mainland District. Team Certificate is awarded to Nimia Padrego, Tarosan Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. Team Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Angeli Tolenteno, 
Sarong Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. Team Certificate of Recognition is awarded to Mary J. T. Don, New Genlo Elementary School, Taitai 2 District. Team Certificate is awarded to Roselle T. Bakarcel, New Genlo Elementary School, Taitai 2 District. Team Certificate is awarded to Winilin M. Dasilio, Panitian Elementary School, Quezon South District. Team Certificate is awarded to Anamarin Simon Dragon, San Nicolas Elementary School, Coron Inland District. Team Certificate is awarded to Kathleen Jisa Z. Manlabaw, De Calachau Elementary School, Coron Inland District. Team Certificate is awarded to Maria Victoria Angeles, Rogelio B. Esteban Elementary School, Batarasa District 1. Congratulations to our awardees. For the information of everybody, from our ESDS, Sir Ari Bentora, there will be a separate awarding ceremony for Gawansi Club winners. So, ang tabayan po natin, ang Gawansi Club. So, all awardees, congratulations. And now, if you have any query or matters to be clarified, it is now our business to clear before we end. But here in our chat box, uh, there are so many questions that are uh, specific. So, the first question sabi dito, status of reclass na may paliwanag na po ito ni Sir Poz. Uh, ang mga merong specific, pwede natin i-chat o i-direct sa ating mga concerned personnel. Isang tanong dito kay Ma'am Chet, baka may isang siyang, paano kami hindi maka-open ng checking account? Hindi kami nagkakaroon ng downloading. Ma'am Chet? Hello po, wala pa si Ma'am Chief. Okay, balikan po natin. Mayroon din ditong tanong na may maraming tanong na nagtatanong kung paano raw mapapalitan ang kanila mga retired teachers na matagal na po nag-retire. Siguro pwede sagutin ito ni, ni, ni admin, Ma'am Bingbong. Marami raw silang mga retired teachers na hindi pa napapalitan. May call in our administrative officer, Ma'am Ma Bingbong. Ma'am, narinig ako, Ma'am Salim. Narinig ako. Hello, Ma'am Bingbong. Hello po. Okay. Kung hindi po masagot ang inyong mga katanungan, ay aming pong i-release sa inyo ang inyong mga query. May maganda pa rin tanong dito, baka masagot po ito. Updates in the monetization. Narinig ko. Okay, sige. Okay. Siguro itong mga katanungan po ninyo ay bibigay po na namin sa sa akin pong concern personnel para may padala sa inyo ang inyong mga katanungan. Titingnan na namin dito sa chat box. Although na naka-record naman po itong ating uh, virtual meeting. Okay. 
for your questions you will just note your questions and uh this is sure na makakarating po sa concern personal ang inyong mga katanungan or you can just have send a private message po sa kanila pa para po ma ma-actionan to agad yung inyong mga hello ma'am hello ma'am ah yes si sir mm -hmm. sir Foss opo yung tanong po doon tungkol sa replacement ng mga retired teacher ah okay mm -hmm. Inaayos na po ni HR ngayon. Sasabay-sabay po kasi ng pag-deploy. Pag ah, okay po. Thank Inaayos you, sir. So, okay, so narinig po ninyo ang sagot ni Sir Foss regarding doon sa... So, inaayos na po yung deployment ng mga teachers doon po sa inyong mga... sa mga pipinapan. Okay, so... I think... Um, patype na lang po ng inyong mga messages and ng inyong mga questions sa ating chat box. So, let us now move on to the vote of thanks to be given to us by our OICSDS, Sir, <coughs> Sir, Arnal, Sir Arnie Javentura. Uh, thank you very much, Ma'am Saline and Sir Yun. Okay, uh, on behalf of our school's division superintendent, Sir Roger F. Kappa, Sir Six, I just would like to extend our Appreciation to the host of this uh, first division virtual monthly meeting with Sir with Sir Roger. Okay, the curriculum implementation division. Maraming maratong salamat sa napaganda yung hosting. And of course, sa lahat po ng mga naging resource person, mga speakers, and sa presence po ng bawat isa ng lahat ng school heads and public schools district supervisors. Thank you very much po sa inyong lahat. God bless us all. Thank you po. Thank you so much, Sir Arnie. And before we end it up, may we request everybody to please open their camera. And Sir Kibian, magpipicture muna po tayo. Can we open your cam? Ayan, sige po. Sir Kibian, paki-picture. Ayan. Ayan. Ilang, just keep on smiling. Keep smiling, sabi kanina ni Ma'am Norris. Ganda naman ng mga dyan, no? Thank you, Sir. Artistahin. Grabe naman. Okay, let's count. One. Ilang screen ba yan? Two. Three. So, I lit up. Let's offer a prayer. A Thanksgiving prayer. Dear Lord, we thank you for the many ways you bless our lives. We know that every good gift comes from your hands. And even though life is not always good, you are always good all the time. We are grateful for your love and faithfulness and for meeting our every need. Please bless and keep safe us all every day. May we live with an attitude of gratitude this day. We ask you, as we close our virtual, meet, virtual meeting, to protect us in COVID-19. Give us always strength and courage as we perform our tasks wherever we go. Cover us, your Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord, for all the hearings and insights that we have gained today. This all we ask in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you very much for the lahat. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. This, this is Pedro Jardinero Dandas Jr. And Mrs. Rosaline Kaabay Gajano. Sign off. Nagsasabi, ingat po tayong lahat. Labanan natin ang COVID-19. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Mama, thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you.